Spine endoscopy is a procedure in which is generally done for prolapsed intervertebral disc or the patient having sciatic symptoms and which doesn't go away with conservative management and spinal injections. So the people who need uh, spine endoscopy can be the ones who are suffering from sciatic pain that would include pins and pricks, the needles and also uh, the patients who are having weakness in their legs uh, they would really benefit from the endos spinal endoscopy. Yeah, certainly this is a better procedure than the con con conventional open surgery as well as the microscope assisted uh, surgery as both of these surgeries could involve general anesthesia and also some stitches and scar marks whereas endoscopy is a stitchless procedure and it does not involve any general anesthesia. Recovery is generally very fast after the spine endoscopy. 90 to 95 percent of the subjects get better just within one day and are, and are able to walk on their own feet just two hours after the procedure. The patient requires physiotherapy and is able to do his own work and starts getting back to his regular routine in just six weeks. Okay, the rehab or the physiotherapy program is very important and it generally starts two weeks after the endoscopic procedure when the wound is healed and it generally continues for as long as six to eight weeks sometimes up to three months depending upon patient problems and but the patient gets better and better and after three months he can do all his activities so the hospital stay is minimized when it comes to spinal endoscopic procedures most of the patients are discharged as the daycare procedure so they don't really have to stay overnight into the hospital Sometimes if the surgery is performed late in the evenings, we, uh, we advise our patients to stay for one, one night and they can be discharged the coming morning.